Well, following his conviction and uh, five-year sentencing in the multi-crow fodder scam, former Bihar Chief Minister Lalu Prasad was officially disqualified from the Lok Sabha today as per the Supreme Court order on convicted netas. Well, Rabri Devi, meanwhile, has made it very clear as to which direction her party would take her take in her husband's absence. Soon after, Congress MP Rashid Masood became the first neta to be disqualified from the Rajya Sabha. Lok Sabha Speaker Meera Kumar issued a notice disqualifying jailed RJD Supremo Lalu Prasad from the lower house along with JDU MP Jagdish Sharma. This disqualification does not come to us as, uh, as, as shocking or as something surprising because it was imminent in view of 10th July observation of Supreme Court. If uh, we have moved to a higher appellate authority and if within three months, hypothetically speaking, if my leader is acquitted, do they have any, any position that how would they then subsequently deal with this disqualification? Rabri Devi, having taken over the RJD's reins since her husband's five-year jail term, termed the court's decision an injustice. While keeping her options open. बिहार के जनता के फायदा होगा कांग्रेस के फायदा होगा आरजेडी का होगा लोजपा का होगा सबके फायदा होगा द कांग्रेस मीनवाइल हैज वेलकम द स्पीकर्स डिसीजन टू डिस्क्वालीफाई द फॉर्मर बिहार चीफ मिनिस्टर हु वाज कन्विक्टेड इन द मल्टी क्रोर फॉर अ स्कैम सुप्रीम कोर्ट के फैसले के बाद यह इस देश का कानून है कि जिसको सजा मिलेगी चाहे वो एमएलए हो या एमपी हो उसकी मेंबरशिप खत्म हो जाएगी इससे देश की राजनीति को साफ होने में मदद मिलेगी और हमारे नेताओं को भी इससे सबक हासिल होगा। Clearly, ahead of a crucial phase for both the Congress and RJD, Rabri Devi making her intentions clear. Bureau report, Times Now.